For scientists or space enthusiasts alike, Mars continues to amaze. It's no surprise the Red Planet is currently the subject of five active NASA missions, three in orbit and two on the surface. And lift off of the Atlas V with curiosity. Seeking clues to the planetary puzzle about life on Mars. You've probably heard of Curiosity, NASA's rover studying the geology and climate on the ground. Now, NASA's sixth mission, MAVEN, is hoping to study Mars from above. And answer a four billion year old question, what made the fourth planet from the sun turn red and barren? It's gone from that polar sterile desert, kind of boring rocks, to this exciting blooming world with a history that does include warm wet times, climate change, dynamic atmospheres, landslides, ice sheets, buried ice, unbelievable. Scientists believe that Mars may have looked a lot like Earth with blue skies and warm temperatures. We do believe that Mars at one point had liquid water, correct? Absolutely. Evidence in the rocks from Curiosity is literally um, unassailable. And we see the record even in the frozen materials in the soils today. Collecting new measurements of the planet's upper atmosphere will give those analyzing the data a better understanding of the climate change over the red planet's history. We expect to learn how the modern Mars works, really in detail, to see its climate state, to understand how the atmosphere has lost the how Mars lost a magnetic field, to take that information and map it back in time. The journey will be long. MAVEN will have to travel 10 months and millions of miles before reaching Mars' orbit. But NASA says the journey and MAVEN's $671 million price tag are worth it, especially if MAVEN can help unlock the big question, did life ever exist on Mars? Chad Myers, CNN, Atlanta.